video it so people can see what we're doing. Okay, good, right there. And let's see if we can push it out. And this warble is just about ready to come out. Let's just not see the poor squirrel to death. Okay, come on closer. They say not to puncture the, the warble because the warble can become toxic to the animal. Mm -hmm. We don't know if that's true or not, but because of that, we're going to be careful grabbing the warble. Don't even know if we can get it out. Because I don't want to slice the skin. Okay, hang on, little squirrel. It's not going to come out yet without stretching that hole a lot and grabbing them. I couldn't get in there actually. It's actually not hard to stretch that hole. Okay. Oh, I got him. I got... You get photographing it? Mm -hmm. Is it coming out good? Yep. <gasps> Oh that is your warble. Where are you at? <laughs> you gotta... Can you get it? Exited from the squirrel. You can take a picture yeah. of the squirrel again. That's his head that we saw moving. Mm. Or his butt. We're not sure which one that is. I was always told it's a butt. I'm not so sure it could be the head. Oh <gasps> Pretty disgusting, yeah. eh? There's a poor little squirrel okay, right here. Let me stop it. Or? No, that's okay. We're going to show our squirrel. Can you see this poor little squirrel that's going to feel much better now that that thing mm -hmm. is out of her? Mm -hmm. Huh? You're going to feel better? Now we're going to flush that hole. You can keep the camera on. We're going to pour a little betadine in that water. And we're going to flush that little boo boo with betadine. When you use betadine, you just go to diluted looking tea, weak tea. We don't use it full strength. The little squirrel's chattering a little bit. We don't need that anymore. Then we're going to take a curved tip syringe. We're just going to flush it a little. And this may not even be necessary, but it certainly won't do her any harm. We're going to flush my face a little. <laughs> and sometimes it's very satisfying to rehab squirrels and get these gross things out of them. Okay, okay, we won't pest you anymore. We're going to let our little squirrel be. <laughs> Put her back in the rotarium. And then you can photograph her over here. Here's our worm again. Anybody wants to see it? Let's see, what do we got? Uh, here's a comparison. This is a two inch femur bone, so you can see how big that squirrel, that worm is. It's still quite lively. And our squirrel's nervous, so we're going to put her away. Come on, Trish, we'll pull her back over here. She's going in her reptarium, along with the other squirrels. She says, Oh, I feel much better now. <laughs> you see her good in there? She says, I feel better. <laughs> Thanks, Ma. Uh, I'm afraid you're going to swore that in my face or something. Oh, God. What is it? It's a warble. It's a warble? Mm hmm. Uh, oh, wow, that's terrible. I've never oh, seen Oh, my God. Such I've a never thing. seen one. I've seen, I've heard about them on squirrels. Okay, I got my instincts. It's a big old bastard. Oh my god, I've never seen Serious, that Alyssa? Isn't that yeah. amazing? Oh. I love my job. Yeah.
OMG. Okay. So now let's get a, this area bathed up and cleaned with some just normal. Is that the only one in there? That's fucking gross. As soon as you killed it, they came out. Pretty much, yeah. Oh man, that's dirty as shit. Oh, these are big things. Fucking gross. Butt maggots. Three ass grubs. Oh, sorry.